gonna grind again I know it's been a little while, but it's time again Folks ask the great, where you gon' rhyme again? I'm like, hold up, give me time, my man See a lot of things change, some stay the same Move from H-Town to D-Town to Memphis, man One thing, it's a show everywhere I go People caught up in these self-money cars and clothes, yeah They talk about it all the time and put it in they songs They drive around and play it loud like it ain't nothing wrong And all they talk about is simple stuff Got everybody acting bad, thinking that they a thug And they trying to drown me out, but now they ain't gon' count me out I got a backpack full of tracks, plus I keep a Johnny Max so we can pan it out Who is Jesus? 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 Who is... Jesus. Our God. <laughs> hey, a person that came down to earth and uh, helped everybody out and died for us. God's son. Uh, Jesus is a Jew and he used to be, um, what, you, what do those people call it again, that they make things? Carpenter. Yeah, he was a carpenter and he made shares and all of this. And that's basically what he was and he also saved people and, uh, Jeez, where, where was he from again? I'm sorry. He's from Nazareth. Yeah, Nazareth. It was this one person that was in power, and he feared Jesus because basically he did. He worshiped him as a god, and that's what made him mad. The savior of the world. The son of God. It's stuff we bumpin' ain't that lean with it, rack with it. No, it's that change in life and please let the rack hit. Who is Jesus? Here's a million dollar question. Well, who is Jesus? Who is Jesus? Couple more. Who is Jesus? Who is Jesus? The man upstairs. I like that answer. Our Lord and Savior. Jesucristo es el hijo de Dios hecho hombre. Our Father. God's Son. Our Brother. God's Son. <laughs> Speaking of God. Our Leader. The Father. <laughs> Somebody who inspired the, the whole humanity. Okay. Cool. God's Son. And who is God? Our Lord and Savior. Those are great answers. Jesus, the Son of God. <laughs> son of God. Cool. He can be the Son of Mary. Mm -hmm. uh, someone who died on the cross for our sins, they say. I think, I'm not exactly sure, but I think Jesus would only apply to like around Christianity and Catholicism. Um, he was a prophet. Basically just a baby of Mary. That was born a long time ago. Helps you correct your sins and you should follow him. Supposedly come to this earth, Jesus' son, to uh, save us from our sins. I'm gonna do it again. I want to know what you think. I don't personally believe in like the Jesus that's said in the Bible, but I mean, I do have a higher power. I believe there is a higher power. Just I don't know. I I just have a hard time believing everything they say in the Bible is true. Mm -hmm. I same thing. I don't believe that he's like this God's son man form. I think he was just. Maybe a prophet from God, maybe something like that, but I also believe in a God, but I don't, you know, Jesus isn't really, to me, I don't think a man can just die on a cross and then all of a sudden everybody's going to be okay. <laughs> You ready? Who is Jesus? The Son of God. And you? The Son of God. <laughs> cool. So even with your your different beliefs now, you still feel the same way about that? I, my son is being raised Christian and pagan, so that when he grows old enough to decide for himself, then he can make that decision with the right, you know, education. It seems like those two belief systems are extremely opposite from each other. Actually, they're not. They're very, very similar in most ways. Um, we have, here you go, here's the, the Trinity knot. Mm -hmm. yeah. The mother, the maiden, and the crone, the father, the son, and the Holy Spirit. They're very similar in a lot of ways. And they both basically follow the same thing, except we don't feel you need to be baptized. Okay, cool. And I believe there are more than one God. Cool. Excellent. <laughs> Who is Jesus? The son of God. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me a little bit about agnosticism for you. What does that mean to you? Um, agnostic is where you believe there is a higher power, not necessarily a god, but a higher power that did, in fact, create everything. But we're based more on the proof 
We want proof. If you can't prove it to us, we don't believe it. I, that's why I don't believe there is a God out there that is there for us to worship and worship Him alone. I, I, I don't believe it. Nobody's been able to prove it to me. I do believe that something created us because, you know, we weren't here and we got here. So, yeah, I mean, you can see the earth. The earth is here. But I don't believe that there was somebody up there thinking, hmm, let's do this. <laughs> Well, you said that Jesus was the Son of God, but yet you don't believe that there is a God. I'm confused. Ed, that's just the answer you wanted from me. I don't want, don't give me answers that you think I want. That's lame. Give me real answers. Who do you really think? That's what I was taught growing up. That well, that's what you're taught, but do you believe that? I don't, I believe Jesus was a guy who was just a really good public speaker and honestly I could tell you something right now but you really don't want to hear it. Oh my gosh, I really, really want to hear it, seriously. I'm serious, I want to hear exactly what you think. I'm not, I'm not trying to get the right answers, I'm trying to get what you think. It's, it's really funny, it's something we came up when we were drinking one night. We decided that Jesus was a vampire who had a brother named Craig. Interesting. You said it. It's too late. He could just pull mind tricks on people and, you know, make them think the water was changing and he could walk on water because he was a vampire. He could float. That's a very interesting theory.